creating a calendar list in SharePoint 2016. To schedule and track team events, use the Calendar List app. In your calendar, easily add events with location, time, and description. You can also track events milestones to manage deadlines. The Calendar List feature helps your team connect around planned events, team tasks, employee leaves, public holidays, or any date important to the group. A calendar list can be created by a site owner. You can use calendar to store team events, including meetings, social events, and all-day events. You can also track team milestones, such as deadlines or product release dates, that are not specific to a time interval. To start creating a calendar list, you will go to Site Contents, click on Add an App, look for the Calendar List Template, here it is, click on the Calendar, type in the name for this calendar list, then click on Create. Here is my team calendar list. I will navigate to it. And to create a new event in the calendar, you can click on the Events tab and click on New Event button. Here you can specify the title, location, start and time description, and other properties for the event. Once specified, Click on Save, and that saves the event to the calendar. So this is how you create a calendar list, and then use that to create events in the calendar that pertains to a team. To automate training and support for your team, install Visual SP, the plug-and-play, instant, and contextual self-help system for SharePoint and Office 365. Over 1.5 million users in over 200 companies are using Visual SP to boost user adoption by over 30% while reducing the burden on their IT support teams. Using Visual SP step-by-step -step interactive guides. Give your colleagues the help they need exactly when they need it. Facilitate employee onboarding with always accessible tip sheets, annotated screenshots, step-by-step -step walkthroughs, and screen capture videos. Accelerate user adoption of your business workflows and improve productivity. To see how Visual SP works, request a free demo. Click the link below or go to visualsp.com.